Oh, uh, what's going on, guys? Your boy X and today I'm bringing y'all Dragon Ball Super Episode 77 review. Now, the reason I said that was because I'm thinking like everybody. I, I should have known. I should have knew better. They fooled me in that damn preview last week. I was thinking everybody was about to just come together and they was about to get the squad back. And the team was about to be just joint. No. No, none of that shit happened this episode. No, no, I can't even say that. I'm, I can't, I can't lie to y'all. I mean, the episode was okay, but the only, it was only two. I can only think of two. By the way, should be short review. Y'all know what that means. <laughs> I'm probably going to go on a monologue and it's going to be longer than it's supposed to be, but yeah, there's going to be two, only two things were important in this episode. One, we uh, found out that Boma's pregnant and she's like real close to having her kid. Do you want to count that as important? I guess another character that's about to join the fray. Might as well call it. And it was, I mean, don't get me wrong, guys. There was a couple things that was funny in this episode, like with whole Vegeta. I would've never thought I would've say it, but I feel like Vegeta is a way better family man than Goku. Like, to be honest, maybe I was just blind of the whole Goku being the main character thing, but the sign's been there, actually. I mean, if you kind of think about it, even back in the day, uh, Vegeta, you know, he trained with he trained with Kid Trumps all the time in the Boo, uh, the Boo Saga. Um, you could kind of say maybe because Goku was dead, you can get that argument. Because Goku did, you know, train with Gohan and stuff, you know, uh, during the cell art. Yeah, during the cell art. And he has Goten. Goku has Goten around from time to time with him and everything. They don't, they don't train, but it's more like a bonding experience. So, Okay, I don't, okay, I'll, I'll take it back, I mean, Goku's okay, family, man, people always give him slack, you know, about, uh, about him, uh, you know, dipping out to go train, which is true, but when he's there, he does, you know, spend some time with Goten, um, but still, I think Vegeta, I don't know, you can tell Vegeta cares, like, I feel like if Chi-Chi was playing, kind of like what Goku said this episode, like, why, it doesn't even matter, you're not having to, like, even Weez, like, you're not having the kid, um, but Vegeta, you know, he cares, like, he's, like, gonna be there for her, uh, while she's giving birth, which, shows that Vegeta, just that character development, man, I they be doing my boy Vegeta nice sometimes, you know, sometimes. I mean, he ain't won no major fight yet. I'm still waiting on that, but <laughs> character development, they do be, uh, they be pushing them in the right direction, so I like that. Uh, the second important thing is we finally got the tournament thing started. That was another funny moment, too. Um, you know, Goku was telling Beerus and Weez that he was going to go talk to Zeno, and... <laughs> Beers and Beers and Weez was just telling them, no, don't do it. You don't know the consequences. And then this was like, I can push the button. I, I can push this button. He'll come here. I can go to him. And it looked like Beers was like about to just uh, disintegrate his ass like he did the Zamas. Like, don't do it, Goku. <laughs> and then he tricked him with the little coin flipping shit. I was done. I was like, wow. And this fool teleported to Zeno. I mean, technically... We could say this episode that Goku was the cause of, I don't want to say that was a universe, I'll say a solar system. Goku was the cause of a solar system being destroyed. Because <laughs> when he got there, and he just made the Z, he just made the Zenos all fucking distracted and shit, knocking the damn, uh, I don't know what the fuck they were playing, uh, solar system chess? I don't know. It looked like they were just killing people. It was... <laughs> Uh, since I didn't do the skit, there was a skit I was thinking about doing where I was just gonna um, <laughs> show clips of them uh, pushing the planets and my ass and going up. Anyways, <laughs> I didn't know what the fuck they were playing, but regardless, Goku got the tournament started. Now, I don't know how Zeno forgot. I guess you could say it's a kid mind, but whatever. Uh, Goku got it started. Um, 
Shit, he said something about that. I don't even remember that goddamn number. That number was so goddamn long, like I was in fucking math class again. I, <laughs> boy, I'm not about to remember that motherfucking number. I just remember it was a king's calendar. I don't. That, I was like, how many days are in a king's calendar? Like, how many days is that? Is that a month in Earth years? What, I mean, what, what is that? What the fuck? Is <laughs> oh, regardless, I'm guessing it's soon. Because, um preview for uh, episode 78 which I'm actually looking forward to it but I hope they're not tricking us again but it looks like um, our universe is about to fight another universe uh, just so the, the, the future Xeno can um, I guess see the strength of Goku and company? I don't know exactly why future Xeno needs to see uh, I guess maybe so they can be on the same page? I don't know but hopefully I'm pretty, uh, well, okay, I'm pretty sure that the fight isn't gonna be next week, like, it's probably gonna be the, it's probably gonna be episode 79, because most likely it's gonna be talking, and then it's gonna be, uh, they're gonna get there, most likely episode 78 is gonna end with them at the tournament about to do, like, a first fight, like, that's usually what happens, so... I'm hyped for the next episode, but I don't want to get my hype too high, because I already know we're not going to see shit next episode. Um, I mean, but that was it. I mean, other than that, the episode was okay. Like, it was just Farmer Goku doing Farmer Goku shit until he got there, until he started traveling to Weed's Planet, you know, uh, Beer's Planet. And then talk to Zeno, and then go to the Kai planet. It, it was just simple episode. Um, what I will say is we finally got to see Goku get shot. Because I was always wondering. I don't remember if it was. I don't remember if. I feel like somebody got shot in the head in Z, but it bent the bullet. I don't remember. Somebody in the comment section let me know. But Goku got shot in the arm and it just bounced off his arm. So I'm guessing, I'm guessing Saiyan skin. I don't know if he, he didn't use Kaina. It just bounced off his arm because he even had like a little mark. It just left like a little scar or a little, you know, a little mark. But uh, yeah, so I'm guessing Saiyan skin must be fucking hard as fuck. Cause <laughs> that shit bounced off. I'm like, damn, it didn't penetrate. It didn't, it just bounced off. And I don't know. Uh, tell me in the comment section too, but I swear it looked like it bounced off his arm and it hit the guy in the head like he just killed him. <laughs> I swear that's what it looked like. Could be wrong, but that would be too funny. Like Goku is just killing people this episode if you think about it. Like a whole solar system destroyed. Um, and he just killed that guy with a bullet deflected. I, I don't know. Regardless, yeah, that was this episode. Hopefully this isn't long. I don't, I'll see the running time. <laughs> but uh, yeah. God damn, they. I was. I guess the opening. Uh, I bet y'all like. Oh, you haven't talked about the over. Yes, the opening did. I did a live reaction. Uh, I'll link it somewhere here, there, somewhere. I did a live reaction, so if y'all want to see that, uh, I gave a little bit of my thoughts there. Uh, go ahead and check that out. But, this has been your boy X. If you like the video, go ahead and rate, comment, subscribe. You know it really helps this channel grow. <laughs> You're gonna keep saying that. It really helps the channel grow, and I really appreciate it. Um, that is it, guys. It's been your boy X, and I'm out. Deuces.